understood only one part of the question, that the Muslims of China are being oppressed. China is a bad country. Why is Pakistan maintaining good ties with China? That's the question I understood. This is the propaganda that is sweeping the world now. The Muslims of, in, of China are being oppressed. Every Zionist and every follower of the Zionist is singing this song. <laughs> but guess who started it? The Huyga Muslims of China live on the land on which the Belt and Road Initiative is to take place. <laughs> Strategically located. That's where they are. So if you could send some some of Dajjal's warriors and you, the CIA will give them the weapons and the CIA will give them the money like they did in Chechenia. These Dajjal's warriors will then go to China and try to bring about an uprising <laughs> sponsored by the CIA. And then the whole world will be told, China is oppressing. But if I am the Chinese government and the CIA comes to give weapons and money to Dajjal's warriors to come and wage war and fool the Uyghur Muslims to go fight in Syria, they're all over the place now. What will I do as the Chinese government? Answer, I'll stamp it out. Because you're threatening the state itself. So don't come to me crying that China is oppressing the Uyghur Muslims. Don't come to me with that. Take it to the CIA. Because that is where it started. I don't have the intellectual acumen of a donkey. I have the capacity to understand what is happening. And this is what is happening now. The CIA and the Mossad and Saudi Arabia and Turkey are the ones who have instigated the Huyga uprising. They did it in Chechenia and Putin destroyed them. And they're doing it in China and China will destroy them. And they deserve to be destroyed. But those amongst them who are innocent and they say, no, we don't want to be a part of this. Guess what they do to them? These same jihad, they go and kill them. Yeah. <laughs> they go and kill them. The same jihad. Go ahead.